My name is Watsi Sutton, Executive Director here at Cornelia Community Solutions. Um, the Max Factor program is one of the first um, educational outreaches um, started in 2013 by the Cornelia Christian Center Church. Bishop Rosia O'Neill um, founded this program um, as a legacy program, which is named after her grandfather, who was her first mentor. Max Factor is an incredible program that takes young men, grades six through the eight, mentors them and helps them to navigate um, life Life, and particularly from uh, for those young men who are from underserved and under-resourced backgrounds. Many of our young men in Max Factor are from single-parent homes um, and may not have um, strong male presence in their lives. Um, however, Max Factor um, features um, several very passionate and dedicated mentors who not only show up at school but um, have just constant interaction with our young men through um, in-school life skill sessions such as anger management or public speaking. Um, they do that twice a month um, at, during the actual school day, but also it features an after-school component um, every day of the school week wherein um, the young men receive um, academic support, homework assistance, um, as well as um, various cultural exposures. They have gone to Broadway plays. They learn, um, you know, find dining etiquette um, and just have exposures to our nation's capital and various the Holocaust Museum just various experiences that many times young men particularly from under resourced um, backgrounds may not have the opportunity um, to be exposed to but what is really uh, and, and those things are all wonderful and the young men enjoy them but part of um, the part of Max Factor that I think is most impactful and Max Factor at this point and it's um, going into its 10th program year has served well over a hundred young men uh, and their families. But part of what is most impactful about Max Factor is that our Max Factor mentors show up both at scheduled times and at unexpected times. Students as well as um, the school officials at CMEPS know that if there's something um, that's going on, whether it's an awards day or a young man is having a difficult time in class, they can count on um, being able to contact that mentor and that mentor acts as a liaison between home and school. Um, having the ability for a young man to have a um, consistent, um, loving and kind resource that they can always reach to um, both with um, questions about academics or questions about, you know, just life issues as they are um, growing into young manhood has been pivotal for our young men. And the heart of the Max Factor program um, is truly our lead mentor and director, uh, Mr. Jermaine Johnson. He is a former um, North Pitt science educator who has a tremendous heart and tremendous dedication to our young men and who have who has led this program for 10 years. Um, this coming Saturday, May 6th, we will have our first ever Max Factor fundraising event, um, an anniversary celebration that is celebrating all the accomplishments of this program. The 100 young men that and families that we've served, 95% of whom have um, graduated from, from graduated from high school, many of whom have received academic honors in high school, as well as um, several have gone on to college. We have a young man now at the University of North Carolina at Chapel Hill, um, several matriculating um, into various colleges and universities um, in North Carolina, South Carolina, and the area, and several who are high school seniors this year having received um, both academic and sports scholarships and who are about to graduate um, from our area high school. So we are extremely proud of the work and the impact that Max Factor has had. But but it costs. This, this program has been available to our young men and families completely free for 10 years. Um, having been established and funded by um, the Cornelia Christian Center Church almost exclusively, um, except during the last couple of years, the city of Greenville has come alongside and provided grant funds to assist this very critical work um, to assist our young men to be all that they can be in the community. However, we know that continuing this work, uh, particularly with all that Max Factor provides, 
um, needs community support. And so we are reaching out to the community and have tickets available for our fundraiser because we really want the community to come, to hear, to see our young men, to see the incredible work that's been done, and to come alongside and help support um, the work that we are doing. We want um, young men in our community to have um, this access to this program for many more years to come so that they can truly realize their dreams and be all that they're destined to be. The fundraiser, it will be at the Greenville Convention Center on Saturday, May 6th, 6th at 6 o'clock. We have an amazing lineup. Uh, we're hoping that the community will come out and be inspired and just have just a wonderful evening and witness just what the um, true power of community impact and partnership um, is and can be right here in Greenville, North Carolina. Um, currently, we serve CMFs as well as South Greenville Middle School. Thanks to the um, generous funding from the city of Greenville, we've been able to um, add a, a an early track component to our program where now we not only serve grades six through eight at CMS, but we have begun serving this year grades three through five, uh, males in grades three through five at South Greenville Elementary School. And the community will have an opportunity to be entertained, but to also be inspired.